Well, I'm sure some of you are wondering what exactly I'm doing at my ex's house. And simply put, I'm here to hang out with my kiddos. As you guys know, I've been staying at my mom's place down in California while I wait for my apartment to be ready up here in Utah. And because of that, this last month, I haven't gotten to see my kids as much as I'm used to. <laughs> but why stay at Kira's place? Why not Kyla's place like you did a few weeks ago? Look at this. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> mm, I'll let Kira answer that one. I'm getting my boobs done. I'm nervous for you. Like, this is a big procedure. Uh, I know how you don't like to do these kinds of no. things and you don't react very well to medication, so I wish you the best. Good luck. Okay. Maybe a changed woman when you see me again. Oh, you'll be different for sure. <laughs> you'll be different, all right? Since she won't even be here for the next few days, why not just spend time with them here in their home where they're comfortable and they're used to this place instead of moving them around and taking them somewhere random. The girls found the spider. <laughs> Levi's gonna get you! <laughs> this works out perfectly. I mean, it's a win-win for everyone. The kids are comfortable, I get to spend time with them. She was nice enough to let me stay here while she's gone getting her procedure done and healing up. Nobody loses. And that's the best part about this. Nobody loses. It's very rare to have moments like these in life where someone isn't getting the short end of the stick. We all win. This is great. This is great. I couldn't have asked for a better situation. Her dad is actually also in town as well, which maybe it's to keep an eye on me. <laughs> and at least I have some company while I'm here. Isn't that nice? Right? <laughs> you know, Kira and I are on really good terms, and thankfully so, because co-parenting when there's bad blood is hard. <laughs> I know from experience. <laughs> We are on good terms, aren't we? Mm. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> yes, we've had a rough patch, but it's a new year. And let's just keep everything that's happened in the past in the past and move forward in a way that'll benefit all of us. we can all move forward from this together. Truthfully, I wasn't perfect in the relationship either, and if you guys saw me at my worst moments, you would probably hate me as well. And so, like I said earlier, let's keep what happened in the past. In the past, forget about it, act like it never happened, and let's focus on the future, to improving ourselves and to making better memories than ever before. Good night, you guys. I'll catch you in the next video.